Avoid these three common Instagram mistakes in 2018 and I promise that your account will grow. So make sure to watch till the very end. What's going on guys? My name's Jack Shepard, back again with another video to help you grow on Instagram. Today, I've got my Your Charisma merch on, repping it till I die. Got the cap as well in the background, except my head is too big to actually wear caps, to be honest with you. But in today's video, we're gonna be discussing all about the three common mistakes I see time and time and time again that people keep making and they're stunting their growth on their Instagram accounts. So let's get straight into the video. And number one is people are simply not willing to invest a single cent or penny or wherever you come from in their Instagram growth. People think that they can do it for free and they're gonna magically grow, they're gonna click a button and followers start running in. That is just simply not going to happen. You need to be able to invest money in whatever business that you do. You know, you need to be investing into growth, into marketing, and Instagram is no different. You need to be spending money on all the different growth methods out there and pushing that forward to helping you grow. Now, of course, on your charisma, there's loads of services from Power Likes, Automation, the Ultimate Virality Package, Power Comments, loads of things on there, which I'll link down below. But you know, you've got to be investing in certain packages or services or ads or running shout outs and stuff like that whatever it is that you want to grow and how you want to grow, you need to be investing in that and testing different methods and how much it costs to gain an engaged follower and then go with the one that actually produces you at the cheapest level. So you need to be willing to invest in your Instagram growth. Like any business, it requires investment. And I see time and time again, people say, Jack, I don't have enough money. I don't have any money whatsoever to invest in Instagram. How can I explode my growth? And to be honest, it's going to be pretty damn hard. Now, there is, of course, methods out there that are, are free. You know, you can do manual work, engaging, doing follow and follow manually through your phone and stuff like that, engaging in your community, using hashtags, hashtags in your stories, maybe doing a few collabs, shout out for shout outs where possible. But to be honest, you know, that all does work, but it's going to be very slow for you. If you're really considering, you know, putting a lot of effort into your Instagram account and wanting to grow explosively, then you need to be willing to put some money behind it. So I really strongly recommend that all of you guys spend some money on ads, services, shout outs, whatever it is, whatever way you want to use to grow, make sure you're investing in 2018 and years to come in your Instagram accounts or your businesses, whatever it is, do that and make sure you do it correctly. Number two is actually not monetizing early, you know, monetizing early enough. I see people spending the money, you know, they're willing to invest in their Instagram accounts, they're spending the money to grow. They might be spending a few hundred dollars now every single month on their growth and they're gaining followers but they don't know how to monetize and they're not monetizing early enough. They think just because you've got 10, only 10,000 followers that you're not big enough to monetize. Now, if you're building a community within your Instagram account, you know, putting out content in your stories, providing value, providing entertainment, educating people, then you should be monetizing and you should do it as soon as you possibly can because the more money that you can bring in earlier on, you can then use that money to reinvest into growth and plow back in. That's why I'm actually able to spend a lot on my Instagram growth, but actually right now it's growing, you know, on a bad week, it's growing on about 12,000 followers every single week. And a good week that I had about a week ago, it grew 20,000 followers in a single week. So you can really see, you know, that is huge growth. I'm growing at least a minimum of 50,000 followers every single month. And on a good month, it's about 80,000. So no, you know, over a year, that's gonna be taking me to a million followers. And as obviously momentum goes by, it's gonna grow and grow and grow even quicker than that but that's all because I've monetized early at an early point you know use that traffic source to send over to my offers send over doing promos affiliate offers my own digital products the like whatever it is that you're doing and even Shopify products to monetize to reinvest into growth so please do not make the mistake of not monetizing early get stuck in dive in get something out there get a product together even if it's an affiliate pro 
product that maybe you use. You know, don't, you don't have to create your own product itself. You can literally use someone else's and take a commission of that as well. So I'd strongly recommend that you get into that straight away as soon as you possibly can with your Instagram account. And number three is people aren't using every single method of growth out there. You know, they might just be doing posting and, and that with a few hashtags, and that's literally their only method. Well, of course, you're not gonna grow that quickly because hashtags, you know, they do work still, but they're not massively effective in growth. They, of course, do help. They will get you some followers because people are using automation software on those hashtags to follow people as soon as they've posted their hashtags, but they're not the greatest kind of followers to have obviously because they don't engage in your content they're just an automated bot but you need to be using every single you know growth method out there or as many as you possibly can to grow your account and then as soon as you're finding the most effective one maybe for the cheapest price whether that's you know viral growth which i use using a lot of power likes power comments getting on the explore page and staying on that long time that has worked out most effective for me but that's not to say for someone else, they're much better at finding influencers, get negotiating, getting a good price on those um, shout outs, and obviously using shout outs to drive traffic over to their account and gaining followers that way as well. And that is a very viable technique that works super, super well. Um, but obviously it's a, you know, for me, in my experience, there's a high level of budget, but maybe I'm not hard enough on the negotiation, finding the influencers, finding the right people, and maybe that is where your skill set lies and maybe you should be heading in rather than the viral method. Of course, you can use story ads, um, follow and follow if you need, if you don't have a large budget. You need to be using all these methods, posting hashtags, story posts with hashtags, collaborations, influencers, ads, uh, viral method, as many as you can pack in all together is gonna help your growth of your account so, so much. So don't just rely on one or two methods, go heavy with all of them, as many as you can, because if you're really serious about your growth, you need to be pushing as hard as you can because building an Instagram account is worth it. Having that large audience of people that can see your content every single day is definitely worth it. So make sure you can't take, so make sure you listen to these three pieces of advice. Do not make the same mistakes that I see time and time again of people doing these mistakes all the time on their Instagram account. So make sure doing and implementing everything I've got to say. And any questions, of course, make sure to comment down below, like the video, subscribe, turn those notifications on, and I'll see you again very, very soon.